بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Brothers and sisters, this is Imam Omar once again here today with Taqwa Tip number 6. The other point that it is that is important for us to incorporate within our lives in order for us to qualify as a muttaqi and to be a person who exercises taqwa is that we must restrain ourselves from anger. Now, it is human nature to become angry and especially given this Ramadan, the long hours of fasting, the intense heat that we're facing, the sleep deprivation that we're experiencing, it's very easy to get agitated and very easy to become aggravated. The thing is that how do we go about conducting ourselves when becoming angry? This is where the real test lies. And a muttaqi, a person with taqwa, is that individual who suppresses his anger. He controls it. He doesn't let it, let it get the better of him. He doesn't succumb to his emotions. Now that is a challenge. It is very easy to say, but it is somewhat difficult to do. And this is why it is an outstanding quality of the muttaqin. Now, if we are having somewhat of a difficult time, we are getting a bit angry with our family, and that's where normally our anger, it gets out, a bit out of control. So if we're around family members, maybe around friends, sometimes even around colleagues, and they're doing something that is annoying us, and as a result, our anger is starting to build up, what we should do at that time is recite, A'udhu Billahi min shaitan rajim And this is based on a narration, in which we find that Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam he had witnessed an individual who was becoming extremely angry to the extent that his face had become red, his veins are starting to stick out. This guy is like a ticking time bomb just ready to explode. And the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam turned to his companions and said to the near meaning that I know of a phrase that if this individual is to utter it, then whatever it is that he's experiencing, it will go away. لَوْ قَالَ أَعُوذُ بِاللَّهِ مِنَ الشَّيْطَانِ الرَّجِيمِ لَا ذَهَبَ عَنْهُ مَا يَجِدْ If he is to utter, أَعُوذُ بِاللَّهِ مِنَ الشَّيْطَانِ الرَّجِيمِ Then whatever it is that he's experiencing, it will go away. So hence, this is a prescription that our Prophet ﷺ has given us when faced with a situation of this nature. So whenever we are starting to get angry and the anger is building up within us, we just start reciting, A'udhu Billahi min shaitan rajim A'udhu Billahi min shaitan rajim Similarly, whatever position we are in, we do, we try and go into the opposite position. If we are standing, sit down. If we are sitting, then lie down. And even if then, our anger is still not going away. And then we should at least go and perform wudu, cool ourselves down, and engage in salah. So hence, this is a prescription that our Prophet ﷺ has given to us. And if we follow it, then inshallah we will be able to refrain from the many things that we may do while becoming angry and succumbing to our anger, due to which we would have to regret for a long period of time in our lives. Another thing that we need to also keep in mind is that whatever position we are in when getting angry, do the opposite of that. So if we're standing, sit down. If we're sitting down, then lie down. And even if then our anger is not going away, it's not cooling down, then go and perform wudu and engage in salah. And like this, we will be able to protect ourselves from the many vices we may engage in if we let our anger get the better of us. Hence, we pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that He makes us individuals who practice this point. He gives us the ability and the strength to restrain our anger at all times and makes us one of those outstanding individuals in His eyes. He makes us amongst the muttaqeen. And until next time, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.